like, and she's asleep. She never responds because she's oh. asleep. All right, here we go. I, I was going to the names. <laughs> well, I didn't know where they were sitting. Oh, hey. Oh, God. Uh, uh, this is not Utah versus Wyatt. This is Jim's Yeah, well. Uh, Brad. One moment. Wait, yeah, I got, got it. it. got it. So, save. Set. Reset scores. Is it right? Yeah, oh. save. You got it right. Hey, I got a... Hi, Taito. How's it going? Yeah, Hoshi 21. That that seriously shook me. But the first time I found that out, I thought I was like, here, no, like it's not 21, it's 12. All oh, right. Um. Like, what? <laughs> Interesting. Looks like Raz is trying to put the pressure on Garchomp. Oh, Catching him with the candle pop. Yes. This is the first time Raz has been in Utah in like six months. So yay, welcome back, Raz. <laughs> And then he's leaving again next week on job. Uh, <laughs> hey, glad to hear it, Dido. You'll probably see a Shadow Mewtwo pretty soon. Um, me, well, yeah, Storm definitely will watch out. Ash. Uh, depending on who we play, it might, it might be uh, first, but then once, once things get serious, he'll go through. Well, depending on what he means with, plays getting Mewtwo. Then I would go Gardevoir, but I know well, that I can. I don't know. Well, I'm sorry, you play him. I, I thought it was someone else. All right, so it looks like, uh... That's, uh... Oh, caught him barely with the clip, clipping him with Stop that overheat. Stop going in, Raz! Stop it! <laughs> yep. Storm is a Shadow Mewtwo. Yep. Um, he's... He's not bad. He, he, you know the stuff. He's definitely not as, like, teleport and tricky as, as you or in the group. But he, he's, he's a good, good stuff. Catching him with the he's a Beyblade. He's really solid. He's uh he's our he's our, our number three on PR. Right now, so just kind of give you an idea where you're oh. gonna hurt. Oh that's gonna hurt. That is gonna hurt. <laughs> it's gonna hurt a lot. Why why does he run with Garchomp? That that just seems how did that <laughs> Not really. You can get attacked and trip up. Well, maybe he's just trying to stop the uh, debuffs that Chandelure can put on. Taito, I'm pretty sure you and him have played the movie East once or twice. Uh, there, there's a time where he grinded out every matchup in the game and just played like you have like every. Man, so I need to figure out what to do in the Shandy MU because I am. Um, <laughs> I don't have characters for this. Oh, just digging on through. Wait, wait, wait. That's gonna, oh, that's that is death. dead. That's that is super death. Why did he white? <laughs> Raz, of course, laughing it off. Yeah. He's a very, very joyful player. Very, very joyful. Oh, that was. I thought it was. Uh, it is entirely. I thought that was going around. No, we're heading into round two now. So th these two have played, th this is like one of our, our old school matchups, because like in our very first weekly, I think, these two were there. Our, our very first Friday weekly, these, these two were there. And I, I think, I think Raz won in winners, Diz won in losers. Or, Diz took the losers, Diz knocked him out in losers, and then Diz ended up making the grand finals. So they, they these two have always gone back and forth. Not only on PR, not only in sets and games, they're always easy. Catching him with the pizza cutter as Raz threw out some buttons. Oh. Oh, the candle pop barely clipped. Good counter. Oh, we're oh. <laughs> that was very nice of Dibs. It looks like he's been. It looks like going to those weeklies on Monday nights have really been helping him out. Get back in the group. That should have worked, but um, he helped counter uh, had been too That should be. Oh, if he hadn't hit spaghetti. a button. Spaghetti. Spaghetti. <gasps> See, normally he comes down with the X and. Oh, uh, uh, so much spaghetti. So much spaghetti. Very nice. It looks like uh, he just. First. First. Good. Five on the kind of that, that dig. Why is he not popping? Why is he not there, there it is. Ah! He's got burst. Oh, he Dude, lucky. Burst. Oh, no. That <laughs> Looks like he doesn't need it because he catches him in the hex, and that was like super death because he had two debuffs on him. That entire time he had Rotom, and almost, and almost the entire time he had burst. 
And he didn't either when he was down like 200 HP. You know what? Brass feels he doesn't need that. No. Sure. <laughs> we'll go with those. Why not? Oh, he didn't need like. Brass, stop. Just going dive in, in and, and homing. That's what you do. Stop. <gasps> Very nice. Now I'm not. I'm pretty sure he didn't cr counter. It was just the uh, crit buff. Yeah, definitely. I, I don't think he counter that situation. All right. Here we go. Let's see who. Very good. That would have done so much damage. Dig straight to all the traps because dig. That's gonna be funny. That might be. He didn't. I think Dibs did not hit a button, so he's fine. Why did he cancel into the swing? He had him, he had the ring. <laughs> Alright, rode him. Hex, 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 hex. Why didn't he hex? He should have immediately hexed, but he didn't need it. Yeah. We are going into game three. So I know why he didn't hex, because he expected Dibs to detect the crap. Probably. But he had room. So anything that Dibs had done aside from that, that little dragon lunge, um, he would have either jumped into the rotor, which in which case he could still combo as he fell, or he would have just got the grabs. So Raz playing Raz. very spaghetti right now, but it's Well that's Raz's important. that's that's Raz's playstyle. Spaghetti and disco. Yeah. Speaking of we have not seen him disco once, I'm disappointed in him. Because it got um it, it used to it used to um in, uh, enhance the time of debuff and it didn't work. So rip. Burn, it might still do it, but like you got like half or something that's so not worth it anymore. All right, after it, it sending out a few projectiles, he... Well, very nice. Not falling for the dig again. Oh, I thought he hexed again. Ah, the overheat did not go off very well. Very smart made this. He did jump back on the overheat. the counter problem. Catching it with the Beyblade. He was just baiting it out, baiting out for the Beyblade. And he it's falls for it again. Raz, calm yourself. First, you can punish these. First, you can burn them. That's gonna get burned. That shouldn't be that. Oh my goodness. I'm not sure what spaghetti I have witnessed today. So I'm speechless. That was actually really clutch from Raz because um, Div always goes for that dragon lunge and can walk up and reset grab. Raz, knowing that, he immediately slid, knowing he'll pop him into Rotom for the for the for the for the for the That was incredibly smart. That's the first time he caught him with that laser. Imagine if he stone edged instead of sand. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh. That's he actually did try to hex his way out of there. That's good if you have a snake. Or, or not. You could just drop the combo too. <laughs> uh, they, they, these guys always have such such spaghetti set. They, they, they normally don't drop combos this bad. Uh, I, I promise, these two are a good player. They're just dropping a lot of stuff right now. So now, like I'm pretty sure he gets shield back up in time. He's gonna break shield though. But it doesn't... Oh! Yeah. Looks like he could still get something off of it. Very nice oh, job. Goodness, so the man. question is, will Raz take this? Oh, Why? nice tech on the grab. Why? And didn't quite catch it with the Beyblade. Why would you dash and grab and shit and lure? Because he's a mad man. Grab it. No, no, it, it um, grab doesn't work. Remember, it gives the 13 thing. Oh, right. I'm so used to my characters being able to grab it. That would have been... Oh, teching it. Oh, that is super death. If it confirms. Okay, it does. That is... This has definitely dropped that confirm before. Well, he's also got tech. It's gonna be great. Yeah. But, uh, that little dragon lunge is into burst. Uh, I think it's a dragon lunge, uh, cancel into the running animation and then burst. And, um... Dibs has definitely dropped that a couple of times. So, uh, if he had dropped it, um, that obviously wouldn't kill because he could just shield it. Punch. But uh, he did get that clutch confirmed. So, we have final game, final round here. Oh, interesting. Uh, I think he's going to be He might have been. Oh. Okay, the, the downward side next. Really scary yeah. Oh, Very nice. he did not charge oh. that all the way. 
that he's dead. Nope. Ibs dropped it again. Now, are we going to see the clutch come back here, or are we going to see Ibs close it out to go on to winners? Looking like... I, yeah. I think it's going to... Oh! <gasps> interesting! Dibs didn't shield. This is going to be double debuffs. With this... Rage Shandy. This, this could easily happen. He could, he could possibly pull it back. Dibs does not have a... Yeah, burst, he's not close to it yet. Extremely scary for Dibs. Uh, it's still definitely in his favor as of right now, but this is getting scarier by the second. <laughs> he's just going to take away both those debuffs. So... Rotoms. That's going to kill. He's dead now. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. Why did you do that? Into, or uh, Stone Age. That would have killed. Oh my goodness! No way. Raz, you madman, you can't do this! What?! Raz, what are you doing with your life? What did he do? I don't know what he hit, but he got hit by that dig. What option did he go for? I 